Well, I, I think what's important to really remember as this conversation is unfolding is that we're not talking about individual events. We are talking about progression of learning in jiu-jitsu. Right. Right. So there's nothing, in my mind at least, there's nothing wrong with quick submissions, having a, ta- having a very offensive approach, seeking submissions, mm-hmm. ending the match in whichever fashion that is. Um, but when it comes to long-term learning process of jiu-jitsu, focusing on defending and escaping will likely take you further with a higher success versus you focusing on the offensive approach in the very beginning of that journey, mm-hmm. right? And that's kind of the reference of what Zanji was talking about, reference of that tree, establish your roots, get the trunk of the tree very thick and stable so the branches can be healthy and they can grow right. and display you know, those leaves and flowers and so on, make it very visually appealing at the end. All that takes a lot of time, a lot of effort, a lot of nurturing, mm-hmm. right? A lot of practice, a lot of patience, you know? And I think was the hardest part, and we've talked about it a million times already, it's very difficult to measure. So the progression as it's all unfolding, yeah. it's, it's really challenging for individual mm-hmm. students to um, have these milestones, reference reference points as is all ongoing. And again, we're not talking about one day. We're talking about years yeah. or decades of the learning process as all of this is all of this is unfolding. 